What's going on? It's your girl Fathom DJ live and direct from the city of Chicago. I am going to further get uncomfortable in the season. I have to. I have to. Because I know what I love. And in order for me to be able to continue to do the things, because it's more than one that I love, I have to further get uncomfortable. I'm being reminded of this because I've been put in a few situations with um, partners, collaborators, friends, and things of that nature. And we are underestimating ourselves and we are being underestimated. Um, And in order for us to turn this corner and get to the point that we can completely see what is to be, we got to get uncomfortable. I was thrown into a level of uncomfortability that I have not experienced in a long time in December. Um, And I'm grateful for it. I'm grateful that it reminded me that I'm resourceful. It reminded me that I'm able to... um, to lean on particular individuals and um, it also strengthened my faith in the power of the process and being patient. And I just wanted to come in and say that to y'all because I just, I, I know what I'm seeing and I know what I'm feeling. Like if I had my way, I would get up. I wouldn't get up. Like let's not pretend like you don't want to stay in the bed until you have to get up until you have, but getting up, getting showered, um, creating a structure for yourself. If you don't have a traditional job that requires you to get up and you have to act like that every day. In addition to a bunch of other things that may or may not be a part of your normal routine of doing, it's just uncomfortability. All of us have this little device in our hands at all times and somebody is making money off of this device please don't hold me to that don't hold me to what i'm not doing with this device in order to um to to further my possibilities and profitabilities but i know that i'm further jumping out of a bunch of windows and and further opening a bunch of windows in order to do that and i'm just here to to potentially have you understand see that over here morning love morning love was started probably it's been over seven years um it was a audio version of my streaming on the internet for a site called spreaker um um and i continued to do it as much as i could even with my moves and I wasn't monetized. It wasn't monetizing. It was just me putting in consistent work, building consistent viewers, listeners, I should say. Um, and I moved it to Twitch. And for a while, I was doing it consistently. I have to re um, address that morning love structure because the other day I did a pop up called Love in the Afternoon. And people showed up in my chat and there was, you know, an exchange. We had a great session and I made some money. Now, everybody's not on Twitch to make money. Everybody's not on Facebook to make money. Everybody's not on Instagram to make money. Um, But if you have monetization and you got a little time and you love what you do, then you can do several things. You can market and promote your events in the real world, and you can do that in many ways. You can do it in many... Oh, look at that. Did you... Y'all didn't see that thumb that popped up. It's kind of creepy, but whatever. You can market yourself and your events, going live, posting them, creating videos, all the things like for somebody to ask you to come to the venue and plug your guitar controller to make money and you got free time and it's something that you say you love doing. And I'm not, don't get me, I don't want you to get this twisted. I don't want y'all to get 
this twisted. You know the value and the worth of what you do, but the universe also needs to see. Nobody else has to see your equity. Nobody ha has to see your sweat equity. Nobody has to see any of that. But the universe has to see you at least attempt. And I'm listening to myself when I say this. Attempt to try. You know, I tried it with one of my buddies in Atlanta. I'm proud of Peter. We tried something and it worked. And we're pushing each other to continue because I believe that when we push each other and it's fair and it's from a space of love and it's from a space of humbleness and it's from a space of God that lots of things will move and shift for your grander good. And that's all I'm going to say because it could get long. Cosmic Kisses, you'll find me on Twitch I'm not exactly sure if I can maintain every morning for morning love. I got to get myself to the point where I can get out of the bed at like 530 or 6 o'clock and find that spot so that I can do it and cut myself off after three hours so I can do all the other things that I have to do within my day. But I'm going to challenge myself to at least dr address it at the top of the week in addition to Sunday's tasting and whatever other pop-up that I can do and all the content and all the creations and managing these schedules and flying in and out, I'm going to try it. That's all I got to say. Cosmic Kisses, you can find me in your World Wide Web Sphere at Fathom DJ in a bunch of platforms, Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, iTunes, TrackSource, Beatport, Amazon. Uh, Threads is in my world now. I'm, I'm popping into Twitch just a bit juggling tasks and things of that nature but you'll find me when you find me cosmic kisses to your day space